It's planting time here in Southern Illinois, and it sounds a little weird. It's November 15th, we got snow on the ground, a little early for this time of year, and actually for the quantity of snow we got, uh, we got about two inches overnight. Uh, it's kind of a, an odd year, but uh, here in the greenhouse it's eight degrees, we got pots filled, and we're ready to start planting. main goal is to get about a thousand out of the 2,500 pots. Uh, that way we don't have all the pollinations hit at one time. And we got enough pots to, to get started today. Uh, um, probably get pollination started around January 1st. Um, and uh, with that, I think we got enough, enough work to get done today. Let's go ahead and get started and see what we can't get done today. Every year we're trying to kind of improve our system and improve the products we use to be able to best suit the corn that's growing here in the greenhouse. One thing that we've done this, or two things we've done this season, is change over to a bunch of biofungicide uh, instilled product uh, for growing media. Um, that way, uh, last year we had some problems with fungus growing uh, in this humid environment, hot humid environment. Um, and about the only place for a fungus to grow over the winter season, so uh, we got kind of attacked pretty hard on the fungus. And so this year I'm going to try to uh, hinder that by having this biofungicide uh, growing media being used. And then we've also switched over and started using a uh, 5 to 6 month 15, 9, 12 fertilizer. That way um, you know, we have plenty of, plenty of uh, fertilizer moving out throughout the season. Some of the longer maturity things uh, we can probably spend a little more time growing. Uh, last year we were running out of nutrients in some of the longer maturity products. So. Uh, that's one of the things that, uh, that one of the two things, or two of the things that we're trying to change this year, maybe be a little better on, and see if it doesn't work. Just finished up planting the last thousand pots here in the greenhouse. Hopefully be able to finish up uh, the last section here in December. Uh, but our timeline is we're thinking pollinations in January and get everything wrapped up with harvest in, in March. Uh, what this greenhouse does is really important in our cycle. It puts us another generation forward, speeds up our cycle, um, basically cuts our time in half for generating a new product. <music> 